this video is going to be about showing you what I like about IronCAD uh, and how easy it is to use. I've been using modelers for over 25 years now and this is by far the easiest I've, uh, I've found. If I want to start a part, I go to my catalog browser, go to a part that's similar in shape, drag it onto my screen, and that's it. And I come grab a handle and I just type in the information. And that begins my part. If I want to continue with the part, I go to another block, drag it onto onto this block. Now I want to position it quickly, grab a handle, shift key, drag it, now it mates to that face. Do it again to this face. So now I know that it's coplanar with that corner. And I want to make it, uh, give it some additional dimensions. I'll make that one. And we'll make that two. And you can see it's right on the edge of that block. Let's create another one on the other side. I would still be working on uh, work planes and offset work planes uh, just to finish these little parts that I've done here. Now if I want to put a hole, again go back to my browser, grab a cylinder hole, drag it onto a face, and on every face it has a center, so I just drop it on the center of that block, make that a .5. drag it through the part. Now I've got a hole that goes through the center of that face. And I'll do the same with the other side. Grab the handle. 0.5. Let's make sure it goes all the way through. Now we've got a hole it, it's that easy. It's, this is this is just a few of the reasons why I like IronCAD. Uh, if I wanted to cut with, with the block, I have a, a whole block. I dropped it midpoint along that edge so I know what the dimension of that part is. So I now know that if I go and make this two inches, it'll push out from, from the center not from one edge or the other but now let's let's make an accurate uh, indentation so I now know that that side is flush I will take this end and we'll make that we'll also make that two so now I know that that goes into and that's two from left to right again no work planes no profiles and here I put a cylinder in here again to the center of that face make that 0.25 highlight it I want to make sure that that edge goes to the face so now I know that that's directly in the face again if I want a hole drag my hole again this is the center of that block drag the hole through the part and it's again it's very easy to use if I don't like the hole I delete that I can use another square hole block setting my dimensions or by dragging all the way through and if I don't want want that I can let's try a slot that's how easy it is to use. These are just a few of the reasons I like it. I like building with the blocks. I like the visualization of it. 
I like how easy it is to make changes to it. I'm not restricted by constraints and, and having to make things together. I'm in the beginning stages of my design. It's, I like it because it's so easy. Uh, I'll continue with other videos showing you why some I like some of the other features. The tri-ball is one that is very, very powerful. I'll do a video on the tri-ball by itself. Thank you. Please come back.